Manila, the Philippine Navy PN, on Thursday said it plans to acquire 100 hectares of cash-strapped shipbuilder Hanjin Heavy Industries and Construction HHIC Phil S facility in Subic Bay, Zambles to build a base for some of its major units. Before we begin please like, share and subscribe to my channel, thank you. Manila, the Philippine Navy PN, on Thursday said it plans to acquire 100 hectares of cash-strapped shipbuilder Hanjin Heavy Industries and Construction HHIC Phil S facility in Subic Bay, Zambles to build a base for some of its major units. About 100 hectares in the North Yard. We will be housing the Philippine Fleet, Naval Sea Systems Command, Naval Installation Command and Amphibious Assault Battalion, Navy Chief, Vice Admiral Giovanni Carlo Bacordo said in a message to the Philippine News Agency, when asked how large a portion of HHIC fill the Navy is eyeing for its proposed base in the area. North Yard, Bacordo said, is located near HHIC Phil's graving dock No. 5, also known as Dry Dock, and is used to construct, repair, and maintain ships. The Cordo said the PN is always interested to occupy part of the HHIC fill in Subic Bay due to the presence of a deep sea harbor which can be used to accommodate its strategic sea lift vessels and larger patrol ships. HHIC Phil's harbor has a minimum depth of about 10 meters which can accommodate the draft of the Tarlac class landing docks and Del Pilar class offshore patrol vessels and incoming frigates. Draft refers to the vertical distance between the waterline and the bottom of the hull or keel. Aside from having a deep sea harbor, the facility is also protected by mountains and the nearby Grande Island. HHIC Phil has a total of 1.3 billion United States dollars outstanding loans, 400 million United States dollars from Philippine banks and 900 million United States dollars from South Korean lenders. In January last year, the shipbuilder filed a petition before the Alangapo City Regional Trial Court to initiate voluntary rehabilitation under Republic Act 10142, otherwise known as an act providing for the rehabilitation or liquidation of financially distressed enterprises and individuals. PNA See you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel, thank you.